Poetic Champion heads to the Wakefield at Group 2 at Trentham this weekend, a race you won last year as well, uh, it'd be nice to do it again. Yeah, it's been a really good race for us, I think we've won it three out of the last five years, so uh, we'll go down and have another crack uh, this year. Yeah, what did you make of his run at Pukekohe? Yeah, a little bit of a head scratcher to be fair, it wasn't the worst run, but maybe a little bit plain. Um, just maybe went a little bit hard up on speed and uh, obviously they put a lot of pressure into the race early in the home straight as well. So. Uh, we've taken the blinkers off for this weekend, he galloped brilliantly this morning um, and might just ride him a little bit more conservatively uh, on Saturday and you know, I think uh, he's definitely improved off his uh, Pukekohe run. One thing, we saw the abilities all there around his trials and, and his first up win, uh, that would give you a real heart going into this one. Yeah exactly and he's uh, you know, pretty hardy two year old, he's bounced through the Pukekohe run well and I thought his work this morning was probably his best uh, that he's produced uh, for us so I think um, yeah, we don't need to find too much improvement for Saturday. Uh, Vinny came in and rode him, he hasn't ridden him before and uh, was suitably impressed so you know, all systems go for Saturday. Okay, we uh, head to Pukekohe this weekend for the Group 3 Bone Crusher as well and uh, you've got Cannon Hill heading that way, a uh, horse who's showing really good ability, how's he? Yeah no, he's worked out really well this morning, um, probably a horse that's still learning his trade a wee bit, uh, he got there quite easily last start and um, yeah, probably just didn't quite know how to, how to flatten off and finish the race off so um, he seems to have proved off that with a little bit of a gear change for Saturday and uh, look, I think the favourite's going to be very hard to beat but I think uh, he should be right in the finish. I think a mile's going to be fine for him, um, he, he hardly touches the bridle in his, in his races so no, I think uh, up to the mile will really suit him.